We're Galvelius Brothers, and I patch the game. We're not like the others who get all the fame. Yes, I'm here, and time for more Galvelius. We've got five of seven crystals, so we're cruising along, just two to go, doing some exploration of Crocky's Forest. And now I am looking for the old woman, who I have to give a ring to, much like before. I hope there's a little bit more of a reward this time. But, if precedent is to be followed, there probably won't be. Here's something I already bought, apparently. Anyway, I have to backtrack a little bit and work my way through the maze forest, because uh, scouting indicates that that is where the uh, woman who needs the ring is going to be. Ow. And that'll let me explore some of the inner areas of the uh, maze forest anyway, so not a terrible thing in and of itself, I suppose. Here's some of those more new enemies, and looks like they're kind of axe-throwing things. And I should be able to repel those projectiles, because that new shield of mine will repel just about anything. Oh, hey, there we go. And we always appreciate a potion, even when it's expensive. I'm doing really well here. There are only, apparently, three maximum life meters that I can get that I don't yet have. And... yep. <clears throat> Do not battle with demons haphazardly. Good advice, I suppose, except that's what I've been doing pretty much all game, and I've made a decent go of it so far. Except for that whole Warlock incident. That went not nearly as well as it could have, I suppose. <clears throat> and this, I think, is the way to that woman. Yes, indeed. Now let's see if I actually remember correctly that this is the woman. If thou art truly good, rescue the princess. I cannot repay thee, but try. <clears throat> now I really have to wonder why the game makes me go out of my way to get rings to give to these women, to get their completely worthless advice. Ah oh well, mine is not to question. Mine is only to seek out holes and plumb them. Fuck you, any. And if I go over here, that I believe should be right about the last of the uh, forest maze areas to explore for this section. <clears throat> Pardon my repeated throat clearings, I seem to be a little phlegmatic today. And we've got a Bible, but I will need to go gold more, so, uh, hang on there just a moment. Operation Money Get, succeed! Fifty grand! Very nice. And I believe that's... whoa. That seems like it shouldn't happen. So let's head over here and see if we can't find the proper entrance to this screen. Have I done this room? I don't think I have, so let's do a little explore. Hey, I wasn't expecting that to work. More stuff to buy, but it's a Maya and not a cheap one, so screw that. Alright, I've been here. So now I need to go around and do the outer path of the forest. And head back up to where I was exploring before, pretty much. Ow. I'm missing a fair amount of life, and I still haven't found the lander here, which is kind of a bitch, but... Nothing to do but roll with the punches as they come. That is the spirit of Govilius. And I've already bought whatever was there, if I recall correctly. Here's where the diving board was. We did that. What about over here? Okay, no joy from the rock smashing. How about killing some water striders if they'll hold still long enough? Okay, that doesn't seem to do anything. How about some tree chopping? Oh, well I guess I just had to kill a few more water striders. That's fine. Draw thy sword several times in front of the bridge that spans a pond. I've done that. I think it's really more of a diving board. 
But no matter. What about over here? We have got various pale dark nuts, paradoxic as that may be. And they are causing me harm. I don't really have a ton of health to spare, so it would be nice if I could stop myself from getting hit soon. At least I can repulse the projectiles. That's a helpful bit of business. And I keep getting hurt. I don't like it. Is there a cave here, like, at all? Either this is the crystal area, or I'm missing something important. I'm missing something important. But it's Dina. Don't waste my time, buddy. I'm not your buddy. for shield. Right about now is where I would be really grateful for finding the blue lander because really my health could be a lot better than it is. And I remember this room. You see where that, uh, oh shit, I shouldn't be here. Uh, I think I shouldn't be here. Those uh, floating ghostly things, I can't kill those yet. They're cl completely indestructible without an item that I don't yet have. And I really, really need to find the Blue Lander. Hast thou heard of a magic mirror which reflects invisible demons? Yeah, that's what I need in order to kill those ghostly things. So, actual good advice from one of the fairies. Rare but valued. What about over here? Oh, moles. We have albino moles. And killing them proves to be of value. Biblical value. 56 grand. These guys fortunately are not too dangerous, because I am really kind of in danger for my health here. But fortunately the cave reveals itself without a great deal of exploration. So yay for that. Hast thou found the legendary sword? I hast not. The legendary sword is the second and final sword upgrade. And it is my hope that I shall be able to uncover it in the near future. Oh god. Die, die, die! I'm gonna blow up the stuff! Yes! Oh, Lander, you're always there for me when I need you the most. I feel much better about life, and I am going to save my state. And this is right around the point where I start really wondering well, that where the hell Rocky's dungeon is. Not only have I not found it, I don't think I've even gotten any hints as to its location. Crocky's cave is next to a river somewhere. Well, there is the advice that I needed, so yay for that. And I managed to be hit by an incredibly slow enemy due to my misjudgment of distances. Yay for me. At least the caves in this forest seem to be mostly easy to find. And one more life meter, but I need to go gold more once again, so give me a moment. Health container, too much TV. Leave me alone, just let me groove with my tunes. Anyway, up to 16 reserve life meters. Very sweet. So here's a river, is this maybe where Crocky will be? Breaking rocks in the hot sun, I fought the law and the law won. I fought the law and the cave appeared. Oh, this appears to be Crocky's cave, but I don't think I can do it before my time runs out. So uh, we'll call it a day, and when we rejoin each other in the near future, we will see if we can take on Crocky. See you then.